So now we have a lady that I, I don't know, I think she's not gonna be besties and we can hang out, Miss Tambra Combs. Do we have a, a crowd over here for Tambra? Oh, this is the lady that obviously went to Party City and was getting some sparkles on and you got her face on stuff too? This is nice. Now she is a Christian humorist. She's amazing. She works with Raymond James and Associates, has been there for tw what, 25 years? Been there a long time. And are y'all related to her? These are the parents. Honey, she's so cute. I see where she gets her cuteness from. You don't mind that I say that. Is that okay? You're both equally cute. I see it's like a half and half thing going on. Did I make you uncomfortable? I, I can start if you want me to. <laughs> she is the cutest thing ever. I just love her. I hung out with her backstage, and I'm seriously just going to show up on your doorstep. Can I come over for tea? All right. Let's listen to the, the wonderful Tambra and her uh, video here. Hey, everyone. My name is Tambra Combs, also known as Thelma Lou. I'm so happy and honored to be here tonight to share this wonderful event and to dance for y'all, but mostly to raise awareness and funds for Feed America First, this wonderful organization that helps feed the hungry. In Isaiah 58.10, it tells us that we are to feed the hungry and take care of those who are troubled. I want to share a little quick story. When I was growing up, um, I had amazing parents, and they're here tonight. Hey, Mom and Dad. Well, we always had dinner around the table at night without fail. And oftentimes, there was one or more people there because maybe they needed a meal or just a pep talk. So what might not have looked like much, because we didn't have a lot, so I kind of think of it as the story of the five loaves and the two fish, it was always enough. And then we would go to the soup kitchen. On Thanksgiving, we would go to the Salvation Army and we would help feed the hungry. So I have a really big place in my heart for helping and feeding others. So my parents who are in their 80s still love to feed other people. And I have a special place in my heart for those who are hungry and those who just need a little bit of joy and love. And as you can tell, I like to eat, so I'm gonna make sure that everybody else gets to eat too. I first learned about Feed America First from one of my very dear friends, Debbie Garvin. Debbie is on the board of directors for Feed America First, and a couple of years ago, she invited my husband and I to come to Dancing with the Nashville Stars. We came and we had such a wonderful time, but we learned so much about what Feed America First does. It really touched our hearts. So recently, I was able to go to Feed America First with one of my other friends, good friends, Kelly Lamb, and they were um, bagging granola. They had received 10 pallets each box weighed a thousand pounds, so there was 10,000 pounds of granola that day. We helped bag into Ziploc bags a thousand pounds of granola, and we had so much fun. It was really hard work. It was hot in there, but just knowing that we were providing a snack or breakfast cereal for someone who didn't have anything in their cupboards was just really special. I have to say thank you to my husband, Carol, who has been a huge support while I've been doing this dancing. He has just as big of a heart as I do for helping others. And honey, I'm gonna get you on the dance floor. I also have to say thank you to all my family and friends and supporters who have donated and encouraged me. My Shake It Thelma Lou team, girls, you're all here tonight. Thank you for all of your support and your prayers and um, helping to calm my nerves. I also want to say a big thank you to each and every one of you who are here tonight for this wonderful cause. Please reach down deep and give to Feed America First. Hey y'all, it's Thelma Lou. I'm here at the National Dance Clubs of Murfreesboro trying to learn how to ballroom dance for this amazing event tonight for Feed America First. Y'all, I'm wearing my devil stompers. We're trying to stomp out hunger tonight and I want to introduce you to a very, very special person to me. Y'all, this is Austin Hollis, my professional dance teacher. Isn't he awesome? 
Well, I got to tell y'all a little funny. When I came my first lesson, Austin said, have you ever danced before in ballroom? And I said, nope. He said, well, have you ever danced? I said, well, sure. I used to be a clogger. Well, if you could have seen the look on his face, it was priceless, y'all. But Austin has taken Thelma Lou the clogger and tried to turn her into Thelma Lou the ballroom dancer. So we're going to try to give y'all a good show tonight. So reach down deep in your pockets and pledge some more money to Feed America First and let's stop out hunger. Shake it, Thelma Lou. Okay, baby. Shake it, Thelma Lou. I'm sure you've heard this before, but this ain't no Andy Griffith Selma Lou we're dealing with here, is it? <clears throat> Girl, he had the tassels a moving, and it all looked good. Uh, I give you a nine. All right, I gotta shake, shake, shake Thelma Lou. All right, go girl, I love your costume, I love your character, I love how you just come out here, own it, I love your song choice, I love your package. This is really amazing, uh, Feed America First and what it inspires people to be a part of and how many people it can actually help and just showing that you were able to get out there and actually show up and be able to help in that way just means such, so much. So. You rocked it, girl. So shake it, Thelma Lou. For that, I'm giving you a nine. I always forget to vote. I just like to talk, sorry. That's why he's for, here for me. It helped, yes. <laughs> no, absolutely loved it. Uh, loved the outfit, loved the spinning, loved owning the character, but they've all talked about dance. What I will say is I, I loved your scripture choice. When you said your video, Isaiah 58, it is one of my favorite scriptures, and I love where it says about feeding 58. I like the whole thing. I'm going to make you read more than one line. I'm going to make you go through the whole thing. But it says that. Not only it says if we do that, that's what builds up the kingdom, and I think that's the beautiful part of what you've done to raise money, to go out and raise awareness for feeding people in our area. So thank you for that, and for that, I'll give you guys a nine. Hey, Doug, Doug, you haven't asked for her headband yet. <laughs> <That's> a tiara. <laughs> tiara. Woo, Tambra, you're, you're wearing my favorite things. Glitter, sparkles, and a crown. Girl, you wore it well. You're feisty. I love your dance stoppers of choice tonight. That was fantastic, and I gave you guys a nine. Great job. Is it Thelma Lou? Thelma Lou. Great job. You shook it. Uh, I was hoping to see some clogging in there, but hey, you are now a ballroom dancer. That was great ballroom dancing. So, uh, and, and very good energy, and I really love like the personality that you bring to the floor and everywhere, I'm sure. Um, great job. Let me give you guys a nine. <laughs> 